Hey everyone, welcome back to Body Talk. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell because today we're diving deep into what's happened in a woman's body during the first trimester of pregnancy, month by month. The first three months are crucial. Your body is going through huge changes and your baby is forming all major organs. Let's break it down together. Week 1 to 4, Mother's Body Changes The first one is hormonal shift. From week 1, your body starts producing HCG. This hormone signals to ovaries to keep producing progesterone to prepare the uterus for the embryo. Progesterone softens and relaxes the uterus, helping the embryo implant safely. It also slightly suppresses the immune system so your body doesn't reject the embryo. Estrogen increases blood flow to the uterus and ovaries and starts preparing the breast for future milk production. Physical symptoms Implantation spotting A few light spots of blood may appear when the embryo attacks to the uterus wall. Cramping Mild abnormal cramps or pressure in the lower belly are common. Breast tendernesses Breast may feel heavier or more sensitive. Fatigue increases progesterone can make you feel very tired even with little activity. Mood swings Rapid hormonal changes can affect your emotions. Digestive effects Slight bloating or digestive sensitivity may occur. Blood flow to the uterus increases to support the implanted embryo. Embryo development Fertilization and early division The fertilized egg, called a zygote, travels down the fallopian tubes toward the uterus. Along the way, it divides repeatedly and becomes a blastocyte which contains inner cell mass, the future embryo, trophoblast will develop into placenta implantation the blastocyte attached to uterine lining trophoblast cells start producing hrcg the hormone detected by pregnancy test in week four early embryo formation germ layers begin forming ectoderm skin and nerve system mesoderm heart muscles bones endoderm lungs liver gut neural tubes forms which will later become the brain and spinal cord. Heart tubes start developing and begin to beat around week four. By the end of month one, the embryo is about two to four millimeter, roughly the size of sesame seed. Most changes in the mother's body in the first months are driven by hormones and preparation of the uterus and breast. Although tiny, the embryo is already forming all the basic layer of the body and the heart. This stage is extremely sensitive. Anything the mother eats, drinks, or takes can affect development, which is why prenatal care and avoiding harmful substances is so important. Mother's body changes in month two. Hormonal changes. HCG continues to raise rapidly, peaking around week 10. This helps maintain progesterone and estrogen levels, which are essential for sustaining the pregnancy. Progesterone continues to relax the uterus and slows digestion, which can cause bloating and constipation. Estrogen support blood flow to the uterus placenta and breast and helps develop the duct system in the breast for future milk production. Physical symptoms Morning sicknesses, nausea and sometimes vomiting is most common in this month due to high HCG levels. Breasts become fuller and more sensitive. Veins may become more visible. Fatigue continues because the body is working hard to support the growing embryo. Mood swings and emotional sensitivity are common due to fluctuating hormones. Some women may experience frequent urination as the growing uterus starts pressing on the bladder. Fatal development. In week 5 to 6, the embryo grows from about 2 mm to 4 to 5 mm. The heart tubes begin to beat and the primitive circulation starts. Brain and spinal cord are developing rapidly. Limb bulbs appear, which will become arms and legs. Early facial features begin forming, eyes, ears and mouth start to appear. In week 7, the embryo grows to about 10 mm. Major organs like liver, kidneys and lungs begin to form. The heart is beating steadily and may be seen on ultrasound. 
The brain is dividing into different regions, starting the formation of the central nervous system, arm and legs development progresses, and tiny finger and toes start to form as small petals. In week 8, by the end of month 2, the embryo is officially called fetus. Size is about 2 cm. All major organ systems are in place, though not fully functional. Facial features become more defined. Eyelids, ears and nose are more noticeable. The placenta is developing rapidly to provide oxygen and nutrients and remove waste. During month 2, the body is undergoing rapid adaptions, increased blood volume, hormone fluctuation and early immune system adjustment to support the fetus. The fetus may be tiny, but all essential organs and structure are forming. This is why month 2 is crucial period for proper development. Many women notice the first real symptom of pregnancy during the month 2, like nausea, fatigue and breast changes. Changes in month 3 Hormonal changes High CG level peak around week 10, then start to slightly decrease. Progesterone and estrogen remain high, supporting the uterus, placenta and breast development. Hormones continue to affect digestion and metabolism and mood. Physical symptoms Fatigue may start to improve slightly toward the end of the month. Morning sicknesses like nausea and vomiting may continue but often become less intense. Breast changes continue, fullness, tenderness and visible veins. Slight weight gain may begin. Increased blood volume can cause dizziness. The uterus is expanding, though the belly may not be visible yet. Digestive effects. Progesterone continues to relax smooth muscles, which may cause heartburn or constipation. Blood circulation adapts to support the growing fetus and placenta. Fatal development. In week 9, the fetus grows to about 2.3 cm. All major organs are formed, though not yet fully functional. Head is still large compared to the body. Fingers and toes are separating and nails begin to form. Reflex movements start. The fetus may wiggle tiny muscles, though the mother can't feel it yet. In week 10, size is about 3 cm. External genitalia start forming, but it's too early to determine sex by ultrasound. The heart is fully formed and beats steadily. Facial features like eyes, ears, nose and upper lip are more defined. Digestive organs like the stomach and intestine continue developing. In week 11 to 12, the size is about 5 to 6 cm, roughly the size of a limb. All major organs and system are now in place, including the liver, kidneys, intestine and the brain. The fetus begin to make small movements, including bending arms and legs. Placenta is fully functional, providing nutrients, oxygen and removing waste. The fingers and toes are completely separated, and tiny fingernail and toenail start to appear. By the end of month 3, the first trimester is nearly complete. Your baby has all major organs and body system, and the most critical period of Organ formation is over. Mother symptoms may start to ease soon as the body begins adapting to the pregnancy. Month 3, the risk of miscarriage decreases significantly after this point. So in the first trimester, your body is literally running a biological marathon and your baby is building all the functions for life. Every symptom from fatigue to nausea has a significant reason behind it. Your body is supporting the most incredible process in the world. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like, share and subscribe. Comment below if you want me to cover the second trimester and all the amazing changes that happen next. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.